Hi guys, and today I'm bringing you a quick, well not quick tip video, an in-depth score streak chain video I'll actually do while I am rushing on this game. And this is before you unlock the higher kill streaks, because I find this very effective on large open maps. Well, it doesn't really have to be a large, but an open map with not much cover. I'll have an example of this little description on the map slums which is one of my favorite maps to run and gun in so yeah uh, the first streak I use is the lightning strike and that is a 750 point streak so 15 kills in domination or well flag caps and stuff so it's reasonably easy to get and its downside is you have to call it in a safe place because sometimes it does take a while to choose your slots on where to call it in and it works best when combined with UAV or a V set and it normally gets about two to four kills on average but this isn't on ground war which you can get about five to seven kills and where it's the most effective kill streak probably that's a low one uh, you normally get about a hundred points from that which won't quite lead you up to your stealth chopper but you'll be fine because the enemies will be spawning and you'll know where they are and the stealth chopper is 1,100 points. It gets the most kills out of these three kill streaks on average, with about five to anything between 10 and 15 kills on certain maps if it doesn't get shot down. And 100 to 250 points that is worth, I believe, it's 25 points for a stealth chopper kill. Not quite sure. Don't quote me on that one. But yeah, it normally gets you the warthog with the lightning strike and the stealth chopper points combined. And also it's invisible to the enemies, so it's a lot harder for them to shoot down, and it is very, very powerful. It goes absolutely ham on some certain maps. And you always want to put this over B flag, because it just shoots everyone. Then, If they're at A or C, it's got more chance of hitting them, when they're on B, obviously. Uh, and also you get the fender kills, that, I think. And the last kill streak, the Warthog, I believe you unlock this at about 35, I think. So this is about, if you're about a level 30 to 40, I'd suggest using this class with a SMG. And it is the best kill streak out of these three on open maps. On open maps it can get between 10 and 20 kills on normal domination. And it's extremely quick to call in while rushing, you just press it like a UAV. And it calls in, and it flies across the map four times, like the st stray from, but the stat used to do three. So this year it's a... Well, it was three choppers going over twice. This is a very, very effective kill streak. It's pretty fun to call in because you just see all this stuff come up on your screen. It's like it drops like bombs, I think. I'm not really sure. But anyway, that's the warthog and that yeah, it totals to about four to forty to two hundred points if you get between four and twenty kills, I think. But yeah, that could lead you on to your next well, third of the way through to your lightning strike almost. So yeah, on to a bit of gameplay now. I will see you on the other side. Peace. Hi guys, and this is the gameplay section of the video. And I'm starting off by capping the C flag. I already got a few kills. I just got this to demonstrate the power of the kill streaks. I believe at the halfway point I was something like 7 and 3 or something. I wasn't doing very well because we joined this game late. So yeah, here's the lightning strike. I called it in a bit late, that is the trouble. If you take your time, someone else normally calls on in. And here I'm playing with my friend Fortress, well, Jibberji, and Cube. I'll put their channels in the link in the description. So yeah, that didn't actually get any kills, so... Uh, it's a bit inconsistent, the lightning strike, but I just thought... You know, I had a, this alright streak with the other ones. And I do like this map, you can single-handedly almost spawn trap them in there, you get the stealth chopper quite quickly even if you don't get that many kills and here, I don't know, this was a really weird part of the gameplay of this little tear and I picked up this gun and I, I, I kept hearing them and I was using MSC but look at that, this is a weird gun I thought it was an SMG but yeah, I heard them, it was it was terrible, you know when you hear them all around and then, see look, I, <laughs> this gun was an LMG, I never even used it before and I got my Warhog after getting one kill while my Stealth Chopper was up. And Stealth Chopper was going ham. And the Warhog only got one on that. 
but I was waiting for it to come over and I noticed they were spawning behind me so yeah my stuff shop is still get, getting kills and there's the warthog got whoa I don't know how many kills it got this like you said a 1 plus 125 I'm pretty sure it doesn't get 125 but it was double XP weekend so it was a bit confusing but the stealth chopper probably got the most kills in this but the warthog does get me a triple at the end and that is a lot of kills with those kill streaks. Uh, it's probably not the best example, but I really wanted to bring you a video as I haven't bought you on Black Ops 2 on this channel. Tomorrow I'll probably be posting a gameplay. So yeah, uh, keep your eyes out for that. Like, comment, subscribe. Uh, check out the guys in the description. And yeah, peace.